Uncertainty looms over the 2024 Hajj operations following the recent fare hike by the National Hajj Commission of Nigeria. Now, this by the confusion, the Ogun State Governor Ademola delegates assuring intending programs from the state of necessary support for this year's exercise. To demonstrate his commitment, the governor recently presided over the third turning ceremony for the state's Hajj camp in Oshogbo. This initiative aims to alleviate the suffering experienced by Oshun Muslim pilgrims every year due to the lack of a proper Hajj camp in the state. Governor Adelike's actions underscores his dedication to ensuring that Oshun State programs receive the necessary infrastructure as well as support for the pilgrimage. Hamid Oibade tells us more. Since the creation of Osho State in 1991 and the establishment of the Osho State Muslim Pilgrims Welfare Board, successive administrations have not built a Hajj camp in the state. It means every year Muslim pilgrims are subjected to inconveniences while traveling to the Holy Land. Uh, preparation of, of uh, for Hajj it requires uh, coming to the uh, governor's office or the the proposed uh, camp to prepare for one activities or the other. In the past years, there have not been a defeating place for people to sit down to do the registration and all other activities. Because of the lack of a Hajj camp in Oshun State, we experience difficulties. We were kept in a small space, and when it rains, we moved to somewhere else. At the third turning of the Oshun Arch Camp in Oshobo, Governor Nuruddin Ademola Jackson Adeleke assured Muslims in the state that the project would be completed without delay to make Arch operations smooth for the Oshun pilgrims going forward. Go to Arch, they be gathered here and relax before the, 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 to go to Hajj. That is why we are laying the foundation today. You know, since the inception of this uh, state, we have been agitating for an Hajj camp. And so the government has never answered us. But this new government here, this governor, the latest uh, administration, the Allah continue to protect them. This is, has now become a reality. Also, the Muslim people are suffering because of lack of Hajj camp. They'll be here for almost two or three days. Literally, all the surroundings of the, the, of the Adi uh, of, of our offices. And this is the reason why we pleaded to Mr. Governor and he yielded to our pleading. And he, today, he now laid the foundation of the Adi camp. But beyond the Adi camp, the real pressing issue this year is the Adi fair. Intending pilgrims who had saved up money to travel this year are not sure they can make up the extra 1.9 million naira recently announced by the National Arch Commission of Nigeria. My whole advice to the federal government and the state government, I want them to interfere with what is happening now. The Oshun State Muslim Community and the League of Imams and Alphas in the state have expressed gratitude to the governor for the Arch Camp project. But intending pilgrims are looking to him to intervene in the area of the fair. Amid Oye Trust TV News, Oshogbo.